Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. Here we have for you a 2006 Audi Q7. It's got the 4.2 litre V8. It's basically got every option available at the time, including side steps, which you can see. It's got the very nice looking five spoke alloy wheels, and it's also got the big brakes. I can see it's got some nice Pirelli tyres on it in near new condition. It's got memory electric driver's seat, Bose sound system, reverse camera, navigation and the list goes on. It has done 163,000 kilometres but it comes with a very good service history. The V8 sounds absolutely fantastic. And this car's in particularly good condition. I believe it came from the Hunter Valley area. The back seats don't look like they've been used very much. It's got two remote keys to it. You can see the Pirelli P0 tyres are in good condition. They would have been very expensive on this size wheel. It's also got an Audi tow bar and it's got an electric boot. Obviously it's a 4.2 litre V8 and it's a Quattro, like all Q7s. It's got an electric tailgate, but even when you look in the back here, isn't it nice and clean? It's, it, it's not full of sand or dog hair or any of those other things you do get on family cars. It's even got a switch at the back here so you can put the back of the car up and down when you're loading. It does have a heavy duty tow bar, even little things like when you look down the side, you can't see any dents or scratches in this car whatsoever. The, even the brakes look to be in very good condition. It's got the big panoramic sunroof. And you've been looking for a, a Q7 and you want to get a V8 with all the options in this beautiful colour combination. I think this is a car to come and have a look at. It's got the nice dark timber inserts. Have a look at some of these books. Great. So you can see the last service is at 160 odd thousand Ks, 145 and then it just goes right through and before that it was at Audi. So it really is very good. And I have driven it, it does drive particularly well. We haven't even detailed it, we've just given it a quick clean. But as I said, it's very, very good. The wheels don't have any gutter rash on them or anything like that. So the brakes feel nice and new, there's no lip or anything on the discs. The headlights are nice and clear, they're not grazed or anything. It's got Xenon lights as well. It is the, the V8 essentially came with most of the options. It was the diesels which and the 3.6 litre petrol which um, where everything was basically an option. This is also an S line. But I think if you've been looking at these, even if, if you are considering buying a diesel, I would come and have a look at this car. Although it uses a lot more fuel, the maintenance cost on these is, is, um, is very similar to that of a diesel. In fact, if anything, it could even be cheaper in terms of maintenance. There's no turbos or anything like that. Diesels do have a lot of filters and things as well. Navigation, I think I've mentioned. Bluetooth, reverse camera, there, you know, that's some of the most important things, along with all the smaller items like your memory electric seats and electric tailgate. So thank you so much for watching. We do specialise in European cars. We have a number of SUVs in stock and we look forward to hearing from you. Thanks again for watching.